Well, hello, folks. And there's Chloe. She's enjoying some of the snow. Today is February 23rd. We got a little bit of snow yesterday, a little bit more today. Not too much compared to the recent snowstorm out in Atlanta. And, uh, yeah, we hope everyone is okay out there. But anyways, the purpose of doing this video is, again, it's 2014, February 23rd, so you can look up on the Alka map the type of weather that we have. Again, we're in Vancouver, BC here. This is an update video to the solar panels that I have. These are just the three that I have, and again, yes, you can add more to it. And I'm doing this update so you guys can see the realistic numbers you get year-round. We are underneath trees. It's uh, obviously no clear direct sunshine because it's snowing and I'll just show you the numbers we're getting all right so here's the ends of my solar panel going to the charge controller I'm gonna show you right now here's your voltage that I'm still getting oops do that again so we're still getting a little bit above floating 15 close to 16 volts but 15.869 whatever um, and again, you see the conditions out here, but that's just voltage. We're more interest in amperage. And there you go. Pretty much nothing. 0 0.09 amps. So don't expect to get much when there's a snow out. Um, again, this is February 23rd. You can look up online for the type of weather we have here. You know, if you're using it to still maintain a battery, it still kind of works because of the voltage, so you can still do the desulfization, however way you pronounce that because I can't pronounce it. I will tell you right now that if I do move the solar panels just out towards the opening, away from underneath the tree, I will get about half an amp, which is kind of cool. Um, but the problem with that is it pretty much you get half an amp for even in this very, very light snow dusting. You get it for maybe 10, 12 minutes and then your solar panels just can be covered in snow. So it's pretty much useless. Um, so for the purpose of maintaining battery, this is how I keep it, just like this. Alright, so if you're planning to use solar panel, or solar power I should say, sorry, if you're planning to use solar power for a lot of charging in the winterish time, uh, you really have to give it a trial run wherever you live. You might get better numbers, you might have, you might be getting more sunlight than I get here. But I'm telling you right now, with the conditions I have, uh, that's just not going to happen. So again, if I move it directly in the open, away from trees, I will get close to about half an amp. But you'll have to be constantly clearing away the snow. Alright, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Thanks for watching.